Africa. Wait, oh, if, no, if you're here, Africa. who's manning the reception desk? Oh, no. Excuse me. Excuse me. All right. So, yeah, I haven't used this thing in a long time. I forgot how powerful it is. Hey, sir, if you were to rate your pain on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being the worst pain you've ever felt in your life and 1 being no pain at all, how would you rate your pain? A 15. Okay, awesome. At the one I've located the subject, it's going to be uh, Grape Seed Main Street. Yeah, we're going to run, run around and search you. I wanted that away. Hello, oceanographers, and welcome back to San Andreas' Finest. Tonight, we are running the Rapid Response Unit, which is our fast uh, medic unit that we have in uh, the fire department. And tonight, we're going to be using the Challenger, which is behind me there. These, of course, are the uh, three different apparatus that we have, or apparatus, <laughs> the three different rapid vehicles that we have uh, for Rapid Response. Of course, we have uh, the Tahoe. The Challenger and the motorcycle, but we're going uh, because it's cold out still, uh, but there is no snow on the ground. Um, obviously, we're not going to use the motorcycle because it's cold and because there's no snow, we don't have to use the SUV. So we're going to use the Challenger, which I haven't used in a while. And uh, yeah, we're going to go from there. So uh, I'm excited to it. Get back into it. Oh, listen to that. I love that. So yeah, we're going to be uh, trying to respond to calls as quickly as possible, medical calls specifically, and uh, see how that goes. But let's get down to Station 8, where everyone is located right now, and uh, see how things go. So yeah, I want to take a minute to uh, actually... I'm just sticking out in the road here. Uh, just talk to you guys for a minute, because I know I took a bit of a break when... Um, this, like, last couple weeks, because I haven't really been feeling all that well. Um, sure. Haven't been sick or anything, just not been feeling it and uh so that's why there haven't been as many videos after new year's uh but i'm i'm getting back into the uh the mode of uh <laughs> putting out content and stuff again so i am excited for that um my motivation comes and goes basically i, I tend to like i'll make a ton of videos and edit them and get them out there and in other times i just kind of you know lose motivation and I kind of drift off for a little bit and I kind of just take time to do things myself for myself and just kind of you know I guess oh what's the word I don't know just just R&R &R, you know basically just taking care of myself because uh, we need that every now and then and, and I work hard I have a full-time job I do this you know um, there's a lot going on so uh, every now and then you just got to take a break and just focus on a couple things that keep you happy keep you healthy and that's that's really important so everyone else should do that too don't work super hard when you don't have to all the time self-care is important fire radio will be 1041 tonight i wish everyone safe patrol are you okay yeah it, it happens it happens naturally it's like a natural mm. thing i do it's how i make my entrance you guys didn't know that by not play, really. fucking face planting if you want <laughs> no, the, the second i come wait, downstairs i hear people getting okay there's like what the hell 14 down cabinets all right that fancy. we don't have pick one and none of them so have handles so good luck and none of them have handles it's, it's those like, it's a modern design chief oh, it's got like but yeah but you have to use your fingernails you have to really dig in there on the edges that's what you got to do we ran a we ran a call on this guy the other day. It was up in you know those nice ass houses in the hills, and he had these fucking things, he, these cabinets. You walk up and you like knock twice on them like a door, and they open. And I was like, <laughs> "What? Yeah, we wish." That's so over engineered. Why do you? It's a cabinet. Like I don't. <laughs> Whatever, man. Car two, show me ten eight ten forty one ten five Lima. Show Just taking and notes active. for my new place. Oh, oh God. What does the note say? Have seven thousand dollars worth of cabinet? I want to like, I want to like digitize my whole, like, smart my whole place. You know, or is that mm -hmm. the term? You know, where you just like everything's like, I can just be like, hey, turn the temperature up to seventy degrees. Oh, like, uh, yeah, like, like so Google Play or whatever. Yeah. Google yeah, Play. Yeah. What? That's some music. Or not, not Google Play. Fucking uh, whatever the Google fuck. Google Home. Yeah. She has arrived. Uh -huh. Oh, look who it is. Oh, my butt face oh. by the chief. <laughs> oh, wow, well, imagine. 
Cheers. What is everybody doing? Good evening. So, your mom. I mean, what? Oh, oh, excuse me. Wow. Who was yeah. that? Who said that? Huh? <clears throat> Family huh? is everything. What? Family what happened? What? Yeah. Nobody that was in my head. What happened? Everything. Nobody turn your back on family. Family's everything. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, sure, I'm gonna be honest. I thought you were a chief. That's why I like so, face uh, ran into oh, you. Wow. <laughs> and then I realized you don't have gray hair like you do. Wow. Ooh. Wow. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Or red hair. He's How can you possibly like confuse me for a younger, more handsome man? That makes no just sense. Said, and then I realized that you're not old. Chief, I'm it's over only because I saw the bat. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, if I turned around, you would have shrieked. How are you, Assistant Chief? Now we can get now we can get the tandem chair lifts and both. I to go did you just call me Assistant Chief? <laughs> <laughs> I meant oh, Deputy boy. Chief. Assistant you just chief. called me Assistant Chief. I did. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Assistant. Assistant to the Chief. General uh, sorry, Assistant I mean, to the Chief. Assistant. You're lucky you rank above me or I'd make you run laps. The assistant to the secretary. <laughs> <laughs> assistant, uh, chief secretary. Wait, oh, if, no, if you're here, who's secretary. manning the reception desk? Oh no! Excuse me! <laughs> Excuse me! Get the fuck out of here! Guys, we got a call! Attention, San Andreas Fire. Medical assist, postal 6188 South Mo Milton Drive. Again, medical assist, postal 6188 South Mo Milton Drive. Be advised, PGs <clears throat> won't be unable to move at this time. Lower left side, sharp pain, underly heart condition. It's going to be in a penthouse, number three, Eclipse Towers. Cards, you show pink one and rabbit in, uh, in route. Pink one, we're not in though. Rapid one, same traffic. Ten yeah. four, sure. Pink one and rapid one and rapid. Oh, the freaking power call center is not supposed to work on this thing. Alright, so yeah, I haven't used this thing in a long time. I forgot how powerful it is. I, I disabled the power call in the siren settings and it's still going off. I don't know why that is. Big intersection, so we're going to use a big siren. A big siren. That's not what that is. Passing station one. Eclipse Tower. That's actually where um, <laughs> uh, Glenon used to live. This is actually his old home. Park right up here, actually. Let's get our stuff. Looks like they are here as well. Get our hats off. Er, so I think it's going to be... Oh, they have this here now. Okay, so it's apartment three. And house three? No, apartment three. Here we go. And for is the door unlocked? Get him. Yeah. I have him upstairs in the penthouse three. If you go to the door to the left. So this is not Glenn's old apartment. He, wait, did he have red carpet? I can't remember. No, he had white. I think. No, he had red. Yeah, this is his old apartment. Now what do we got? He says he's in pain. He's trying to point to where it is right now. Hi, sir. My name is Paramedic Reese with the San Andreas Fire Rescue. Oh. Can you uh, go ahead and tell me where it's hurting? Oh, right near my stomach, right 
Oh, right it's on, on the right side. It's on your right side? Okay, awesome. Oh. I can barely move. Okay, what's your name, sir? George Langdon. George Langdon. Awesome, George. I'm just going to get some quick vitals on you while my partners look you oh. over, okay? <laughs> okay. George, do you have any past medical history we should know about? I am a heart patient. Your heart patient? Okay, can you uh, I smell give me a little bit more information about that? I have a pacemaker. You have a pacemaker? Okay. Did I just take... Oh. Oh, I want it. I see anything. It's it's weird. Oh, here it is. Here. Oh. <clears throat> okay, sir. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put these little sticky things on there. They're a little bit cold, but this is going to give me a picture of your heart. It's going to give me an idea of what's going on there. Okay? Okay. Ooh. Let me know if we need to start a pain metal. I'll get that set up. Okay, sir, if you were to rate your pain on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being the worst pain you've ever felt in your life, and 1 being no pain at all, how would you rate your pain? A 15. Okay, awesome. Yeah, Chief, we Holy want to get some uh, meds rolling for you. Yep. I want to just check for any allergies or anything like that before I start it. Yeah, I got it open right now. No medical allergies listed. Sir, do you have any medical allergies or anything we should know about that's not listed on your patient profile? Um. Oh, let me see. Let me see. No, um. Penicillin and morphine I'm allergic to. Penicillin and morphine. Awesome. Thank you. All right. We're going to avoid right. both of those. Well, my. Oh, my good Lord. Alrighty, sir. Well, my life pack is getting me a readout on your uh, heart rhythm. I'm going to go ahead and take your full vitals, okay? Okay. Are you finding it hard to breathe at all? Yeah, just a little. Awesome. Okay, sir, when was the last time you ate something? Whew. Um, probably about uh, at dinner time, maybe about couple hours ago. Real quick, sir. I'm going to uh, put an IV into your left arm, all right? Okay. I feel a little pinch. Oops, that's wrong. Alrighty, sir. Are you on any medications currently? Uh, not at this time. Okay, awesome. What were you doing when you started to feel this way? Just lying in here. You were just laying down? Okay. Is there any position that is more comfortable for you to lay on? For instance, if you're laying on your right side, is that more comfortable to laying on your left side uh, or laying on your back? I can't relay on my right side. My left okay, side Okay, so the pain maybe. is worse laying on your right side? Oh, yeah. Okay, man. So here's what I'm going to do, okay? I'm going to set up my portable ultrasound right now because what I'm thinking is you might have a case of uh, appendicitis or something going on in there that I can't see visually with just my eyes. So I'm going to use this, okay? Okay. Alrighty. Um, Jackson, if you'll go ahead and get a pulse and respiratory rate for me because I didn't get a chance to get those yet. Hey, Reese, also, if it's... And this, if it if it is appendicitis, what are you thinking about a um, anti-inflammatory? Do you think that would work at all? Yeah, let me get this set up because I want to see it real quick. And uh, your pain levels should start going down very soon, sir. I got you on some fentanyl here. It's very fast okay. acting, so. All righty. Yeah, this gel's gonna be cold for you, but I apologize. Have you felt like you were gonna throw up or anything like that today? Oh, I feel like I want to throw up right now. Okay. okay. Oh. <laughs> All right. You guys, a pulse of one fifteen beats per minute, and then a respiratory rate of twenty. Yeah, he's going a little bit. Awesome. All right, man. I'm just gonna take a look at the. It also says uh, here in his, he's got uh, on the CAD uh, underlying uh, heart condition. Did we cover that already? 
Yeah, I asked him, and then I ran a 12 lead, and I was looking at a rhythm, but I don't know if it didn't return, or I didn't see it, if you actually want to just look at that life pack. Gotcha. Hey, Jackson, if you'll get your pulse ox set up on him real quick, I would mind yeah. having a pulse ox as well. Okay, sir. So it is looking like you're going to have a case of appendicitis, okay? Because your appendix is looking rather inflamed on your right side over here. All right. <laughs> so um, what the chief over there is going to do for you, he's going to run you some uh, anti-inflammatories, okay? And then okay. Um, we're going to do our best to get you out of here with as little pain as possible and get you rolling to the hospital, okay? I'm going to run some uh, Toradol. I think that'll be the best option for now. Just a small dosage until hold them over to get to the hospital. Okay, perfect. Pulse Ox is showing 97. 97, awesome. Did you want me to run and get the uh, backboard? Um, I have the... It's on the stretcher behind me. Oh, you brought the stretcher upstairs. Yeah, yeah, I brought the stretcher up. Shit. All right, turtles flowing awesome, along with sir. the fentanyl. If you were to describe your pain to me, does it feel like a piercing pain or a radiating pain? Oh, it feels like something's going to blow up or something. Okay. I okay. Don't... Whew. That's All about right. as best. And about as how long has this been happening? It must have started probably about five minutes before I called you guys. Okay. Okay. All righty. Well, you did the right thing by calling us, okay? So we're going to slide this backboard in up under you, and we're going to uh, strap you down to it, and then we're going to move you over to our stretcher and get you out of here, okay? You're going to feel a little bit of discomfort as we roll you over to slide the backboard under, but once you're on the backboard and once you're on the stretcher and once we're moving you, you should be able to uh, lay in whatever is the most comfortable position for you, okay? Okay. Awesome. Chief, if you don't mind, I'm going to hand this backboard across to you because there's two of us <clears throat> on this side, so we'll roll him this way. Yep, that works for me. There. Okay. Thank you. All right, Jackson, are you ready? Yep. All righty. So, uh, Mr. Langdon, are you ready to ready to roll? Yeah. Perfect. Okay. I'm <laughs> Literally, we're gonna roll into wood. <laughs> ready? One, two, three. Roll. Oh. I know. There we go. Know. There we go. Let me know when you're good to go back down, Chief. Yep, we're good. Oh. Okay, we're gonna go down on three. One, two. Three roll. Oh. Perfect, Jackson. You'll strap in top side. Yep. I could swear, yeah, Glennon's old apartment okay. was red. I could Sir, swear. is there anything my partners can do for you blue? while we're getting out of here? Do you want them to grab your phone, your keys, lock up the place for you, turn lights off, anything like that? Just grab my phone and lock the door. Okay, awesome. Uh, Chief, do you mind doing that while we're moving him out? Yeah, no problem. This is actually my old apartment, so I know all the oh, switches okay. are. Perfect. Alrighty. Um, Jackson, you're at the head, so if you'll count us off for the lift and move. Yep. Are you ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Alrighty. Move you over here to the stretcher and down on your count. One, two, three. There we go. Perfect. Alrighty, well, we'll get you rolling out of here, okay? And then we'll have the chief bring your uh, keys down to us so we can keep you, uh, keep him with you at the hospital, okay? Okay. Perfect. You want to put a blanket on him? Yeah, yeah, I'll lay it out on him right now. Where do you keep your uh, keys there, sir? Over there on the counter. You want to stop you got a blanket over you, so it's pretty fucking cold out there. Yeah, 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 here. Hey, Reese, why don't you take these from me? Okay, sweet. There we go. All right. All righty. All right, let's get you right here. Hey, like in the apartment here, sir. When did you move in? Oh, I've been here for a couple months. Yeah. yeah. I used to live here myself, and I moved up to Vinewood. Oh, it's nice over here. Yeah, it's a, it's a good tower here, too. You 
on him Reese. Perfect. All right, we're going to slide you in. Big bump in one, two, three. All right, IV bags are, uh, or bags are attached to the uh, stretcher there. Actually, I'll hang them in the medic here real quick for you. All right, you guys should be good to go. Perfect. Thank you, Chief. No problem. Have a, have a better day, sir. Thank you. Fire radio to medic one. Go for medic one. May I have an update on that call, please? Yep, we're going to be in route two pillbox uh, right now. Uh, priority one. 10 4, strong medic one in route two pillbox. Medic 1, you can advise Pillbox Control, we're going to be in route with approximately 39-year-old male, conscious and breathing, showing signs of uh, appendicitis. We have performed an ultrasound and have pushed meds. We'll be arrival in 5. Proceed. Desire to leave when I say, say I wanted that away. Tell me why. <laughs> Ain't nothing but a heartache. <laughs> Can't reach to your heart. He's ready to go. Chief, he's been singing like this the whole time. I wanted that away. Yeah. Tell me why. Nothing but a heartache. Tell me why ain't, ain't nothing, nothing but, but a mistake. mistake. Tell me why I never wanna hear you say I want it that way. Fire Am I medic one back course. Fire. Okay, who knew that Warner had a voice like this? Holy shit! I did not. <laughs> yes, He's been like this the whole time. I knew it. That is too late. Cause Chief wants it that Yeah, way. baby. Tell me why. Ain't <laughs> me <laughs> but Tell me why. Ain't ain't nothing nothing but a mistake. Well, tell me why. I never want to hear you say. I want it that way. This is why it's going to I want it that way. Fire department's got. So, talent. so Chief, I, 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 I feel we should, we need to give uh, Warner some PTO, <laughs> just, just, he, just so that he can go to the. Uh, Hello. What is it, Los Santos got talents or whatever the yeah, hell it is? Well, Seriously. I don't remember the really lyrics get... to all of this. I, I don't know say, how I, I know so know many songs. My brain, it's just stuck. Okay, I know talking to the moon, song. Bruno Mars. Talking to the moon. I know you're somewhere out there, yes, sir. somewhere far away. <laughs> I want you back. Every time oh, I hear look, that, you got Katie crying over there! Katie's crying! <laughs> I don't know what I know. No, <laughs> no man, don't cry, what do you need? You know, C Civic, Civic gave me an idea. I think we need to just have our own talent contest here in the firehouse. Ooh! Yeah. Yeah. They talking back! They start talking back! Yeah, if we all want to yeah, fucking yeah. Yeah. That's gonna so give you all time to prep for it. Everyone be quiet, I want to hear it. up my room. I sit by myself, oh. talking to the moon. Hey, there we go. I'm trying you need to, to see get Warner to and you. Street together. In hopes you're on the other side, talking to me too. What oh, am I oh, for? Damn. It's alone, <laughs> talking oh. to the moon. Is it getting hot in here? Uh, I'm, I'm feeling whoa. flushed. Yeah, me too. Oh, oh Warner should have been at that uh, thing at the yellow like track. I'm feeling like I'm saying this. Talk oh, of yeah. the town. Thank yeah, what'd you guys say? time ago. Almost heaven. West, West Virginia. Virginia. Yeah. Warner, why don't we even the street go together? Shining on the river. Life is old there. Older than the trees, <laughs> younger than, younger the, than mountains, the mountains, flowing like, like the breeze, breeze country roads. Take, take me home <laughs> to the place <laughs> I belong, West, West Virginia, Virginia. Mountain, mountain Mama. mama. Take, take me home. home. We're gonna go ahead and meet up.
up at the gallery for a little yeah. meetup. <laughs> All units can attend. The ghost 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 losers get in. To job Rapid to one, two, oh, car two. We're currently doing a karaoke thing over at Station Eight. We might be detained. Where are we going? Wait, where are we going? Oh, where are we going? Oh, what's, the, what's the location? We're, 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 what's the location? Sorry. Where are we going? Oh, God, I'm a medic now. Medic one. Warner's entertainment. Medic one and medic five roaming. Medic four from the medic one and medic five roaming. Where are we going? Car two from station eight. Where are we going? Go four. Didn't she say to go? What? What's up? What's, what's the, the address? address? Go to the LA, Car two. It's gonna be the Galileo Observatory, just north of the city. Night. Don't hit him! What do you mean? I'm not hitting him, but I'm gonna blind him with my headlights. So oh, here we go. Now see, this is go. a red light. You stop at these and you go <laughs> and it turns green. <laughs> <laughs> you come to these roads often, boy? Oh, you wanna go? <laughs> you better empty that water tank and your bladder if you want to beat me, boy. <laughs> I think you might need to empty your bladder before you got to go in five minutes, old man. <laughs> oh, here we go. Okay, that's a good one. <laughs> I know it's a good one. Holy shit, you just found engine two. Ah, jeez, they're right behind me! <laughs> Stuck between this the tail of two engines. I'm just stuck between them. Yeah, it's a wild lanes vehicle since they're not a good enough department or uh, branch. Wow. Off. Yeah, don't, don't let like Garland know about that. <laughs> Car two to rapid. Rapid one. You can come up here. I was joking. Oh, okay. I'll make my way there now. Wow, so is, that what you were is that you were just waiting for me? Is that what you were doing? You were just no, for me I was hiding? literally down the road and you said that. I was like, I just made the corner at the yield sign <laughs> down there. I'm like, oh, okay, I'll make my way here. <laughs> oh my god, and you just flung you flying. Glad I wasn't. <laughs> well, I see, honestly, I thought you were in your fly car, so I was going to pull up next to you and be like, hey, I'm here. <laughs> oh my god, it's great. Oh my uh, god, that smart car is just booking it. I mean, it, it helped that I had a uh, engine five like pushing me up the road. So. Oh yeah. <laughs> now we're running bat out of hell in here. Oh, you know, it's, it's that challenger, man. Yeah, I, I got to take advantage of it when there's no snow on the ground. Oh, I bet. Uh, by the way, you totally missed Warner singing the Backstreet Boys back at Station Eight, and oh my God, does he have a voice? I'm not even kidding. Really? Where's Warner? Yeah, have him sing it. Senior Firefighter Twenty. What? Can you, can you, can you sing Backstreet Boys for me? Hell? Oh, oh Jesus! Oh, please, here we go. Please, this please. is what it comes to. Bow, 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 <laughs> I feel like I'm a firing bow. line right now. Like I'm about to oh, change. Oh, Jesus oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. Let's, let's, right. come, let's right. go over to the observatory. Let's go over to the observatory, and he can see out to the city. Yeah. Oh, wait, don't hit me, don't Warner. Hit me. I can. Don't hit me. We can oh, make a we line. We can park engine over there blocking the lane of traffic. Who's the bright driver? Engine's parked on the right. We're the fire department. We can block whatever we want. Yeah, there's fire engines for some I.e., this fire lane right here. We're here, for training. Training. Yeah, we're, we're here for training. Training purposes. We're here for training purposes. We're doing pre-planning. Kind of like that wetsuit training we did down at Mirror Park, and we were actually just sitting there fishing. <laughs> I mean, oh, some of us were fishing. The other ones were diving in after the fish. Found an Fish's engine. No fish in that as well. Yeah, I found a motor in the bottom of the lake and everything. Garland Sorry, you found a what? In the what? We found a motor. Someone dumped a motor in uh, Mirror Park Lake. What kind of motor? Like an, a, a car motor. Why is it yours, Civic? Is that why you're asking? It's not mine. We are no strangers to love. I'm sorry, huh? You know the rules, and so, so do I. Wait, 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 wait. A wait. full commitment's yeah, what I'm thinking of. Missing... Oh my you God! You, have you have won't slow. get this from any, any other guy. Uh, oh my God! <laughs> 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 
<laughs> feel it. I wanna make you understand. Never gonna, gonna get you up. up. Never, Never gonna, gonna let you down. down. Never gonna, gonna run, run around, around and desert you. Never gonna make you cry. Never gonna say goodbye. Never gonna say goodbye. It hurts you. Come on, guys. Let's come by. All right. All right. Warner, you're starting. You're starting off that Backstreet Boys song. Oh my God. That's an order. I really hope that we get a that's call an and nobody hears the guy. radio signal up here. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's all I hope. We're about. fine. We're fine. Start it off. Let's go. All right. Uh, Hello, Tom. You are Hello. my fire. Gonna look up the loop. The one desire. Believe when I say I want it that way. Cause Tell me why. Oh, no, not yet. I can't reach to your heart when you say, Really, Reese? I want it that way. Now? Is it now? Tell me why it ain't nothing but a heartache. Tell me why it ain't nothing but a mistake. Damn, bro. Don't leave me out to dry. I never want to hear you say, I want it that way. Am I your fire? Your one desire, yes, I know that it's Ooh. too late because I want it that way. Tell me why it ain't, ain't nothing, nothing but a party. Tell but me why it ain't, ain't nothing, nothing but a mistake. <laughs> so Tell cool. me why I scene. never want to <laughs> hear you say. I want it that way, cause I want it that way. Can we like is that what you want to Warner to? That was fucking amazing. Is that, is that what you asked amazing. Amazing. Yeah. Yeah. I, I cut out the middle yeah. part that was boring. Yeah. That's, that's, that's fine. That's fine. Oh, that was amazing. So in terms of what I'm hearing, Reese, you don't quit your day job, and Warner, follow your dreams. <laughs> 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 My dreams are to go base jumping. No, 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 I'm fine. You said to follow my dreams. My dream was to go base jumping. My dream is to fly. Garland said not to quit my day job. I thought about jumping too. Chief said fly. Corner. What? Huh? All right, let's go. Oh, uh oh. Oh, so, uh, oh, no. I believe I can fly. <laughs> That's appropriate. No, we're not back in touch. We're up here. No, back down. I believe you. So, Campbell, I'm thinking yes. we need to have a talent competition at the fire station one night. We totally should. Spread my wings and fly away. I mean, we're going to do it at the end of the day. I believe I can soar. That's, a, that's actually a great idea. See me yeah. that because there should be plenty of room there for it. I believe I can fly. Alright, can I you jump can. off now or no? So no, you cannot. Right. <laughs> In this wait, direction, oh, wait, yes. Does this remind you of anything? I used Every to rule night. the world. Oh my god, that Captain Sparkle song. I know what you're talking about. I'm gonna fall in kingdom. Yes. Uh, Please be careful. Hey, I'll Warner, if you don't get off that thing, I think that um, you're six feet from the edge. I think six feet is too far down. Hey, why don't we get that on that platform? Because I'm on the edge. Yeah, we decided to <laughs> <laughs> I'm on the edge. Thank you, Civic. Thank you for getting that. Excuse me. Yeah, let's go in there. Oh my god. Like Everyone to jump then. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, no Wait, uh, Warner, can you can you be my jack? I follow my own drum, Garland. I don't <laughs> like your drum. Your drum is very interesting. Well, then don't beat my drum. I wasn't playing. Or anything else for that matter. I, that is very. <laughs> in my dreams, I see I'm holding you. Him. Where did you get the teddy bear? No, I'm holding him. You don't see it. Oh, look at this. It's beautiful. You all are beautiful. Never let go, Jack. Oh, Never let go. Except that car, too. Wait! <laughs> Just kidding. That's way too high for me. We got a romantic song for us instead of that. Yeah, we're singing, My Heart Will Go On. What more do you want? <laughs> Well, I, sure. I want more romance. Hello? If you, you know, know what I want, romance, then think about the people. Right what is what the uh, 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 I mean, me, me, you can, me, So Campbell. you can sing that type of music. Can you sing stuff like like a boss? 
Oh god. Well, do you know oh, like a boss? You mean the one where he like throw he kicked a baby in the face like a boss? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What? I, I only know what? the joke one, but like island. What no. is the guy? Island City or whatever? Lonely Island. Or Lonely Island, yeah. I okay. just had. Never mind. I'm not gonna. No! <laughs> no! 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 <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go down there and give you front lighting for a picture. Oh boy. Oh, here we front go. Front lighting. I hope he falls off the cliff. Oh, oh my God! God. <laughs> Everyone. Attention, dangerous fire. My biking accident. Postal two zero one oh, three. Oh, got it. Main Street. Again, biking accident. Postal 2013, Grapesy Main Street. Give us PT crash on pedal bike, hand crush on impact with mailbox, hurts on movement, swollen, no ventral bone injury. Give us patient is wearing a orange vest. Car 2, show medic 2 engine 2 rapid in route. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Always do it on my own. So the board for our medic two and a two and rapid and rapid. I know is to love what I'm doing. Never give up, never slow till I finally prove it. Never listen to the nose. I just wanna keep moving. Keep my head up when I act. Head up, that's a fact. Never looking back. Grab it, one around. Keep, keep my head up, staying strong. Always moving on. Feel I don't belong. Tell my boss to move it along. Push myself to be the best. Try to be the best. God, this road is so windy. I gotta be careful on it. Out of the way. Sorry, I mean, it's only a pedal bike accident, so I don't have to respond that quickly. I mean, obviously the person's hurt and needs help, but it's not like a... It doesn't sound life-threatening. Now, of course, I'm sure there's plenty of instances where we get a report like that, and then it turns out to actually be a life-threatening. So it's, uh, it's worth, you know, still responding quickly, but I'm not, like, responding to it as if I would to a cardiac arrest. So... I'm gonna be careful, watch out for locals, because on those turns like that back there, they tend to swerve into your lane thinking that that's what you're doing. So it's worth driving very carefully, especially on these back roads. I'm gonna get a little speed there just because it's a straightaway and there's really no traffic. Traffic's light. Doesn't mean to be on the wrong side of the road there. Thank you for stopping. Attention, Sandra, sire. Reported smoking vehicle, postal 9013 Dutch London Street slash Davis Avenue. Okay. Again, postal 9013 Dutch London Street slash Davis Avenue. It's going to be a white and color vehicle on the sidewalk. Smoking, unknown or about occupied the blocking stairwell at this time. Car 2, show myself. Uh, medic 5, engine 5, and ladder 1 en route. Okay, where is this accident? Let's look at the CAD real quick. Uh, Main Street, Postal 2013. 
21013 is going to be back. Yeah. Show Raptor 1 the area attempting to locate. Proceed for Raptor 1, show you in the area attempting to locate. Rapid one, I've located the subject. It's going to be uh, Creepseed Main Street, 2013. I'll be on scene. Hi. Receive, Rapid one. Hey, how you doing? How you doing there, miss? That hand hurts. All right, you hurt your hand there, it looks like? Yeah, I kind of got smashed by the mailbox. The mailbox was open, and Done for I from got medic two on scene. And then it got smashed and I pulled it out. Okay, can I see your hand real quick? Is anything else hurting as well? Uh, no. Just the hand. Then four engine two showing engine two on two. Alright, I'm just gonna kind of poke it around a little bit here. Yeah. It might hurt, okay? Yeah, that hurt. That hurt? Okay. Uh, looks like she fell and, um, possibly broke or sprained her hand. I'm just checking right now for either. Gotcha. Hello, man. My name is Can I Morgan with Sandra's in this. Uh, can you tell me your name real quick? Helen Knight. It's, it's hard to move my fingers, too. So. <laughs> All right, I'm going to feel each one of your fingers here, and I'm also going to check your wrist. I want to see which specific part is broken, okay? And can you tell me how you fell uh, again, just so that my medics here can also hear you? Uh, yeah, I was you know, kind of just trying to stay out of the road because I didn't want to get hit by a car. And I kind of went close to the mailbox, and the mailbox was open. And my hand, the only fall, my hand just got smashed in two. The gotcha. mailbox kind of closed on my hand. Okay, I gotcha. All right, let me see here. All right, looks like it's your wrist. All right, yeah, it looks like a couple of your fingers are broken. I think this one here is sprained, this little piggy right here. Coach, show me in the area attempting to locate. All right, so here's what we're going to do. Uh, these two wearing blue behind me here. This is uh, paramedic. Uh, Central, McCullough and Paramedic, uh, in the Morgan, they're gonna give you a hand here. Oh, well, sorry, that's... <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say it that way. Uh, <laughs> it's okay. They're, um... <laughs> that's a terrible point, I didn't even mean to do it. Um, they're gonna put a splint on your wrist and your fingers, alright? Just could be like little clamps that are gonna go on there and keep it straight and, and uh, level. And then we're gonna have to take you down to the hospital to get looked at, okay? Okay. Alright, I'm gonna hand you off to them. They're gonna give you a hand here. All right, thank you, Chief. Mm -hmm. All right, I looked at her medical info, and now she's there's currently not in my nose, so. All right, on a scale from one to 10, uh, how would you rate me? It's like a four or five right now. Gotcha. Look at your hand. Have you lost any consciousness? Uh, have you blacked out or no. felt like you're gonna be dizzy? Oh, okay. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give you a wee stress ball and I'm gonna... Is, is it your left or your right hand that you've broken? It, it's left. Your left hand. So I'm gonna give you the stress Fire ball to put in your right you hand. Because when I put the splint on, it's gonna hurt a wee bit because it's gonna... It's gonna move your bones a wee bit and that can hurt a quite a bit. So... Give you that. Squeeze as hard as you can when I put this splint on. And afterwards, if you need it, we can give you some medication. How does that sound? Okay, so on the count of three, I'm going to put this on and then we'll uh, bandage up your fingers just to make sure they're not moving either and then we should be all fine. How does that sound? Mm -hmm. It's on three. One, two, three. And on it goes. 
I know it hurts. That's it done. That's everything. Okay. All I need to do is put some bandages on your fingers just to make sure they don't move at all. You don't want any damage in your nerves, nerves or anything like that. That's what you're supporting you. Mm. I'm just going to slowly wrap this around your finger. Let me know if this hurts you at all. Advised, it's, uh, it hurts you a little bit. Be advised, if you come up to the top of the nice parking area, uh, there's a PD unit that's going to take us. If you feel like that you're about to throw up or pass out, above just above uh, go ahead and let us know. The arena. Okay. You'll need to come around to where Postal 9008 is. I'm not sold Get up, up on that main road and it's going to be here at 9006. Uh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um. You okay, then? Okay, so now Rapid that we've one, got car this, two, you good? So now that we've got the splint on your hand, oh, how much pain would you say you're on a scale of one to ten? Oh, four or five. Four or five. On four or five. Do you think you need any medication to help with that, or are you fine until we get to the hospital? Uh, I think I'm fine. I think you're fine. Okay. Oh, are you okay to walk? Or would you like us to get a chair for you to move you over to the ambulance? I'm okay to walk. You're okay to help. Okay, so in a second, myself and my partner Morgan, we're going to help you up. We'll bring you over to the medic. We'll get it nice and heated up for you. And then we'll take you down to the Sandy Medical Center. What does that sound for you? Okay. That's up super. So I'm going to go heat up the medic right, for you and Morgan will get you ready to do a fantastic on. night. Hey, miss, is there anywhere you would like... Actually, you know what? If you'd like us to, I can put the bike in my trunk. I'll take it down to Station 2 over here. And we'll uh, secure it for you. You can come pick it up another time. Okay, cool. Alright, I'll do that for you. Yeah, my place is like for the drunken ducks. Okay, yeah, just come down to station two when you're better and we'll uh, we'll give it back to you. I'll do. Actually, uh, engine crew, I'm gonna put this in your vehicle. My trunk's a little too small, probably. As soon as traffic clears. There we go. 